Tokyo City Air Terminal connects Tokyo's two airports, Narita Airport and Haneda Airport, with the airport limousine bus. It helps to get access to hotels and other places easily. It's a convenient and important transit spot for people coming to Tokyo. Serving as a tourist information center, the entire building of TCAT has been renewed. By introducing the latest ICT, such as digital signage with tourist information, a well-equipped friendly guide service system for all foreign and domestic customers is available. Along with a tablet equipped with new generation of multi-language compatible simultaneous interpretation application, there is an increased number of staff available for foreign visitors. On the touch panel type, tourist information terminal, peripheral tourist information with route searching functions, Japanese animation tourism information and emergency medical information is provided to foreign tourists. Collaborating with overseas internet reservation sites by social media and the regional DMO, Destination Management Organization, the target is to establish a proposal-based tourist information center. By offering luggage storage service, empty-handed sightseeing has become possible. The same-day baggage delivery service to Narita Airport, the premium hands-free package, is also offered. The Tour Expo program, which suggests travel plans around the country, is being displayed from a large 4K monitor. Together with local sightseeing images, the images of tourist attractions are broadcast live from cable television stations and tourist site introduction events are held regularly. At Airport Limousine, barrier-free access like increasing the number of limousine buses with a lift and multilingual compatibility is proactively promoted. With Tokyo 2020 and the future in mind, under the concept Friendly to All, TCAT has become a crossover node connecting Tokyo and Japan with the world. Cherry blossoms have become a symbol of Japan. Although Yoshino cherry trees are the majority of species in Japan, there are also many other varieties. For centuries, Japanese people have favoured cherry blossoms. Sumidagawa is a representative river in Tokyo flowing from the north into Tokyo and then to the sea. There are cherry blossom trees for about one kilometre on both banks. About 300 years ago, the general leader of Japan began planting cherry blossoms. With the fact that the sky tree, the highest artificial structure in Japan, can be seen nearby, it has become a popular spot for many cherry blossom viewers. Many cherry blossoms are planted around the area nearby imperial residence of the emperor and has become a place of relaxation. At Kitano Maru Park, there is a famous Purokan serving as a venue for sports and concerts. Since it is one of the most popular cherry blossom viewing spots in Tokyo, there are many foreign tourists visiting that area. We are very happy to see this Shakura of Japan. Actually, we are very excited. So, uh, it's a great pleasure to see the Sakura. But yeah, it's the first time we see the cherry blossoms. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Only on pictures before. Mm -hmm. It's very beautiful. Yeah. 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 It's amazing. All the colors. Visitors make long queues to visit a garden and witness colorful cherry blossoms. Very beautiful, very pure. And yeah, I like this is a different view on the day and at night. Yeah, I enjoy both of them. Yeah. Cherry trees are not only planted in tourist spots, cherry blossoms in full bloom can be seen everywhere in everyday life. Stunning cherry trees are lining up along the railway track, which is the main transportation system in Tokyo. Cherry blossoms are a sign of spring in Japan. It will for sure keep on bringing joy to people's eyes and hearts.